Hello, beautiful people. How you feeling today? You know, just when it seemed like or that it appeared as though with what you're working with or with what is before you, that you've been exposed to having had to or have to or still is or are dealing with, you've gone as far as you can go with dealing with that or relating to that, or you're just going to just give up on that and just let that go. It's, and then you realize it's not as bad as it seemed or as it appeared, or then there are there's some turn of events that occur or take place that you just didn't see coming. Hello, beautiful people. How you feeling today? Good, thank you. Happy Father's Day to you and your family. Look at those beautiful smiles. Wave at the world. <laughs> Thank you. It wasn't as bad as it seemed. And then you realize or you took note of the fact that what you really needed to relate to or to come to grips with or to deal with was right there in front of your face. All you had to do is not just open your eyes, but just relax, succumb to it, let it go, and let it flow. Open up your soul and relax and be free so you can experience the joy, the relaxation, or the comfort of being comfortable with just letting it be. You know, this is the big fight Unfortunately, from time to time, or some of, some of us still do, that we have with ourselves. That is usually the biggest battle, or that, that's the mainstream of your fight. It's, it's, it's uh, I mean, you're looking for the enemy, and you're looking for the enemy on the outskirts. You're looking for the enemy on the far and beyond when the enemy is right there with you or right there in front of you. Don't mean to make it sound like that is really just an, an, an enormously, outrageously out of control thing or such a bad thing. Growing, changing, healing, overcoming, becoming a better version of you, the lying dormant version of you that's been waiting patiently to come through. That's not such a bad thing, you know, as it may appear. With the resistance that you put up or the walls that you put up or as a result of the fact that you have done things or have succumbed to doing things or have become comfortable with doing things and that same old manner of speaking, that same old habitual rotating, you know, uh, uh, comfortable with, content with, comfort zone way of thinking, living, and doing things to um, expect or having tried and saying it's not working with what you're still doing that you always have been doing that it's not working, expecting better results, different results, when all you had to do, all you have to do, all that needs to take place coming from you, or that's lying dormant in you, waiting for you to say, that's it, I felt that, that felt good, that was a different experience. Or, I've done this so long, in the same old manner, in the same old way, the same old mentality, and the same mindset of doing things for such a long time. And I've been doing it this way. And this is all I know. It's the only way that I know. It's the, it's the only thing that I know. I don't know anything else. Well, you know, it's like trying, trying different entrees and, and, and you know, and, and, 
in, in, in different meals, you know, um, different cultures, you know, different foods from different cultures, you know, having different experiences, you know, um, uh, uh, you know, uh, going to um, a low level door on an apartment complex as opposed to the, going upstairs, a different experience, not doing the same thing the same way all of the time. But now, this is finally starting to come into mind. It's finally starting to seep in. It's finally starting to soak in. It's finally starting to come to fruition. It's finally starting to get your attention and being an intention getter to have had your attention gotten. Now it's starting to resonate. It's starting to make sense. Wasn't making sense before. Just wouldn't gravitate, just couldn't get your attention. I mean, you just know I'm set in my ways. I've been doing it like this all of my life. What need now is there for it to change? Well, change is not such a bad thing because change is a good thing. You know, depicting upon how you view it and how you look at it. Hello, smiling lady. How you feeling today? You got a minute so I can interview you? You feel like being interviewed? <laughs> Just remember, I just wanted to love you and treat you right to encourage somebody else, okay? That's okay. Your smile is that way, all right? Enjoy your walk and have a good day. You're welcome. You know, um, yes, always trying to improve on encouraging you beautiful people. You know, I love to invite the outside to the inside because the inside don't always come out to the outside or don't always show up on the outside. So when the outside comes to the inside, the inside can be, the outside can be an influence to the inside to come to the outside. You see how, I know it sounds kind of contradictory, but it's paradoxical, you know, which means it may not sound like it makes sense or that is true, but it is, you see. And, and so I know that may have sound like a little, sound a little mixed up and a little confusing. It's not meant to be that way. It's not meant for you to think of it that way, and it's not meant to sound that way. It's only meant to be one way, and that is in a healing way, a changing way, a better you of thinking and living way, a, 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 a happier you in the day, a, a, a more smiling, and it's consistency being you in the day of your life and in the life of every day in every way in your life for you to have that life-changing experience, that, that transformating that experience, that experience that says that I like what I have become. I, I like, I accept, and I appreciate what is becoming of me or what has become of me. Excuse me, head just itching a little bit there. Or what has become of me because... You know, as a, according to my own free will, not feeling forced fed, not feeling misled, or not feeling like that I was placed in a position where I had no alternative, no other, other alternative but to do it. Because if I had been given the choice, according to my own free will, I would have endorsed the choice to choose to embark upon this experience in which he speaks of or have spoken of in terms of or regarding me having an I feel good being me moment this day in this way. I think that I'll do this again tomorrow. I think that I, I'm going to incorporate this into my everyday life, way of living and thinking. I like the way that this feels. I like what I see now when I look in the mirror. I see a better, not more complex, not stoic look, not frowning to the grounding, but upbeat. And it feels sweet. I feel complete. I feel like I'm in a better place to enjoy being me. To all you beautiful people out there in the world, I love you and have a smile.